Hi, my name's um, Andrew Hansford and I'm a professional educator. Um, I have a clinic in London and a training academy just about to open. We're on live stage at 11 o'clock, 11.45. What I'm trying to do is do combination therapies, which I think are becoming quite popular now. Advanced therapists are having trouble sometimes working out which combinations to use. And appeal before any treatment to me is pretty much mandatory but it's using the right peel to make sure they're not going to cause any trauma to the skin, especially with microneedling, which is trauma-based treatment. Um, we need to do something that's a little bit more calming, which is to remove the stratum corneum, and then we can go on and, and get a better result. So it's going to be a little bit more about combination therapies. A lot of people are very confused over, can we, should we, are we allowed to, etc. It's just trying to put them on the right pathway to get the best possible treatment results they can get with the products they have at hand. I'm the ambassador basically for Philmed by Philorga. Philorga historically is a mesotherapy company, arguably the best in the world because it's the first one to really bring it to fruition or bring it to the marketplace. They're 40 years old, CE registered, which is incredibly important. Um, they also are one of only seven companies in the world that make their own hyaluronic acid. So up until January this year, it was medical only. Only doctors and nurses could ever use their, their product and in January, as I stated, they opened up a portion of their product portfolio to the beauty industry, and it's gone phenomenally well. So the medical side is injectables and deep peels, that's the sustained medicine, but the beauty side, or the advanced beauty side really, is uh, the mesotherapy that can be done with medical needling and nappage techniques. And there's lots and lots of information on the website that you can pick up on. I'll be there all day, both days, on stage most of it to be honest with you. So I really, really hope you're to see you.